Would you like to view or restore changes made within your JotForm tables? Let me show you how with revision history. Hey JotFormers, welcome back. I'm Kimberly. And like I mentioned, revision history within our JotForm tables is extremely powerful. It's gonna let you view all of the changes and even restore previous versions of your tables if you so choose to. So I am already in my JotForm dashboard and I'm gonna go ahead and choose a form that one, I know has submissions and two, I know it has some revisions in it. So I'm gonna go ahead and choose this second one, clear out. I'm gonna choose more and then submissions. Now there are two ways that we can access this revision history. Up at the very top, we can see the name of this table is clear out, which is the same name as the form. I can either click the arrow that's directly right of it and choose our revision history, or right underneath that we can see it says last updated at 11, 11 a.m. and then a little revision circle. We can click that as well because it is a link. And that's the way that I'm gonna go ahead and go, I'm gonna click right here. And we can see over on the left hand side, we have the complete revision history. Now, all of the revisions are chunked together by time. And up at the very, very top, we can see that I'm on this first one and we can see that there are 16 edits made within this time frame. And if you have more than one person within this table making edits, it'll show you the last person's username right up here at the top. Now, if I go ahead and click on this drop down arrow on this first version of edits, I get more information about what is happening. And I can also click on each one to visually see what was happening. So for example, this very first one, I can see that I created a clear out tab and I made it into the card functionality so I can see all of my, all of my submissions in card view. The next one down says that there was a column that was edited, so let's choose that one. Now with this one, it's going to highlight the columns that were edited, so it looks like every single one of these columns was edited. Now here I can also see that there was a column name that was updated. Underneath that, I can see that there was a cell that was edited. The, both of these, the cells were edited. So if I click on these, I can see that both the first and second one were edited. The last names were edited to Paige and Smith. And again, whenever you click on one of these, it's going to highlight it so you can see exactly where the change was made. Let's go ahead and jump down to the next revision history. So I can see that there was a column deleted, used to be called email. Let's jump down to the next one, another column deleted, new entries added. So every time someone submits a form, it's going to update here as well. But let's say that I want to restore my table back to this version right here where the column was deleted. All I have to do is go up into the top right corner and click on the restore button. We have this pop-up that says, are you sure you want to restore to this version? I'm gonna go ahead and choose yes, restore to this version. And there we go. And if we want, we can head back up to our revision history take a peek at this drop down, and we can see that the restoration is a part of that history. And it's as simple as that. If you have any questions about utilizing revision history with your JotForm tables, let us know, and I'll see you next time.